I'm okay. I'm okay. I think it's me. Oh, I wish I could talk to you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about everything. Oh, I just wish I could talk to someone. It's all falling apart here. I can't believe what's happening. Strange. Such a little thing. That's her? Nicole? Yeah. First deferred from her in weeks. We're five minutes out. You still got that thing on repeat? I guess you really miss her. Bishamer is not a job you turn down, but six months apart with only fit calls? It's rough. Easy to say the wrong thing. I don't blame you. I'd listen to my girlfriend over Hammond reciting security protocols. Forewarned is forearmed, Miss Daniels. So you keep saying... Here we go. Nice clean re-entry. Six months staring at that chunk of rock. To an independent miner, that's paradise. Aegis 7 is one of the richest finds in CEC history. Some prospecting team set up for life. Now, where is she? There. I'm busy eating my humble pie. In visual contact with USG Ishimura. What a beauty. Biggest planet cracker in her class, you know. And it looks like they already popped the cork. Why is it so dark? We should be able to see your running lights. Yeah. I'll get us into hailing range. Someone's got to be waiting up for us. Just be careful on the approach. I'm not taking any chances with the CEC's pride and joy. No chances, huh? Is that why you were digging into my personnel files before we left? It's just like guys. guys. I'm a computer analyst. It comes with a job. I ran standard CEC background checks, Miss Daniels. If you want to work in the big leagues, you have to play ball. <clears throat> Thank you, Mash. Sorry. We're in hailing range. USG Ishimura. This is the emergency maintenance team of the. It USG helps to be a little genre savvy. Call. Come in, Ishimura. I don't think I can skip the intro cutscene, Stank. Ishimura, do you copy? Come in. This is the USG Kelly. You ever hear of a full communications blackout on one of these things? Never. Come on. Someone pick up the damn phone. That? It was going okay uh, so for a little while. The array is busted. Maybe a uh, broken encoder. Daniels and I can handle it in 48 hours, Max. They've got a lot more range than I thought they did. Yeah, I hope so. Jen, Johnson, take us in. Gravity tethers engaged. Automated docking. Let's go. We're losing control. Fuck! We're off course! Daniel! Guidance system override isn't responsible. Shit, shit! We're coming in too high! He's gonna smash us into the hall! Chance! Aim for that emergency stabilizer! There! The blue light! It might slow us down! Guys, drop the blast shield. Everyone fix themselves. Oh, Good call on the stabilizer, Isaac. That I always read the manual. What the fuck's going on with flight control? That guidance system's a death trap. Better add it to your repair list. Jen, what's our damage? Calm her down. We lost four for and. sure. We've got a fire in one of the stabilizers and... Singularity core's a mess. Could be worse, but not by much. And let's get some help. Johnston, stay with the Kelly. We'll send a medic. Everyone else, with me. I'm not used to seeing Isaac without his mask on, his helmet on. Feels weird. It's okay though. Crap, he came down hard. I don't know why I thought that was the exit. Why did I think that was the exit? I have no idea. 
Hello? Where is everybody? Half the ship must have heard that landing. Be proud, Chen. You got us here in one piece. Johnson might disagree. Yeah. But you're off in about the first round. Of I would have meant something to steady my nerves, especially on CEC staff. You see anyone in flight control? No, nobody. Yeah, the range on their attacks earlier was a surprise. I don't, I didn't remember their attacks being quite that long. So I'm gonna have to keep that in mind if I don't want to eat it again. May as well get signed in. God, imagine getting all the way to like the end of this and eating it. Can't read security. Same for the chief engineer. What is wrong with their comms? Someone left in a hurry. Where's the security detail? Where's anybody? There's nothing logged. No duty roster, no power to the elevator. For God's sake. That security console is still working. Isaac, get a damage report. I'm done playing around. All right, back to it. Something on the floor here. Seth? I, I need that damage report. Oh, God, it that smell. Did Isaac notice blood? What have you got, Isaac? They're really picking up the clues Shit. early, aren't they? It's not just comms with the guidance system. Half the Ishimura's in the red. Engines, hull, the trams. Who could do that kind of damage to a planet crater? Okay. Power. Ventilation's up. Power to the elevator ship. Positive anomaly detected. Quarantine activated. Another malfunction? No. The quarantine systems are all fine. Oh, wait. Do you hear that? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I hear it. Yeah, man? Take it easy. Daniels, get those elevators running. There's something in here with us. Up there! Oh, all right, bye-bye, Chen. Yeah, we're just gonna turn this way and wait. And then we're, and then we're gonna run like hell. Come on, come on, come on, come on, Isaac. Let's go, Isaac. Woo. All right, it's time. Awesome. Oh. <laughs> anyway, last day. You could probably skip cutscenes. Actually, I'm not totally sure if you can skip cutscenes entirely, but like you can't skip that cutscene. So if we have to restart, yeah, that's gonna that's gonna make us watch that every time. Oh, so good. You sign up for the hard stuff. Well, you know, they they start bringing the hard stuff. <laughs> oh, Casey, how are you? Damn! Go down. I gotta aim better. Ugh. 
came over from TikTok and encouraged watching my streams. I appreciate it, Casey. Thank you so much. I'm glad you're here with me. How are you doing? Oh, God. TikTok has been... TikTok has been pretty good recently. Security request retrieved. It didn't die. We shot that fucker right between the eyes and it didn't die. Smith had to shoot its fucking arms and legs off. For God's sake, send help! <laughs> Isaac. Oh my god, Isaac. You made it. Just... They're everywhere. Shen, is he, uh... He's... gone. Nothing I can do. What the fuck are these things? The ones I saw... Some of them were wearing Ishimura uniforms. They're the crew? How the hell can they be the crew? Look at them. We need to get to the bridge. There's a thousand people on board. Someone will be there. We can't. The tram system's wrecked. Everything's locked down because of the quarantine. And you're both repair techs, so how do we do this? There's a broken tram car blocking the tunnel. It's gridlocked the system, and the data board's burned out. I can't lift the lockdown or call the tram until we get a spare from the maintenance bay. But it's all on Isaac's side of a quarantine. I'll handle it. Just make sure there's power to the repair systems. And Isaac? Yeah? I'm sure Nicole's okay. She's a doctor, right? She'll do the smart thing. Yeah. Right, you're right. Yeah, she always does. Find somewhere safe. I'll be back soon. Yeah, I'm glad too, Stank. <laughs> Imagine if they did. How, how, how pleasant it would be. It's a pretty good game, Dread. I... I like Dead Space. I haven't played Dead Space Remake all the way, but you know... When I saw impossible difficulty, I had to say yes. Because, I don't know. SK just loves a little bit of punishment in these things. Woo! I go hard or I don't go at all. I don't know, is that Stank or is that like one of our other guys? Who would own the murder, the murder elevators, really? I could see I could see Will owning one. No, I think I could see Mecha Slurpy owning one be re for being real. Balls. Yeah, I played the original two a while back. It's really it's it's a hard game to play because of the the turret. In it. Like everything about it, everything about it is pretty good. But then you get to that turret section, and God, I don't know how like you would do it on impossible. I don't know. I don't know, man. There's probably a way to do it that I just don't know about. But I'll be damned if I know how. <laughs> You beat the remake, though? Well, yeah, well, the original seems like it's really, 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 really hard. I was playing the original over on, like, TikTok a little while ago. I played it for a little while. Uh, yeah. We'll say that it wasn't really doing the numbers that, say, Resident Evil or even Silent Hill does. Doesn't even slow them down. Okay. The only way is hacking them apart. Those arms, their legs. Is that even children? Or do they just stop moving? Prepare systems online. Loading system reinitialized. Warning. Autoloader malfunction. Please contact a repair technician. Whew. 
All right, let's go. Everything is fine. We're gonna be using a lot of stasis here, I think. Yeah, as hell, we're gonna win. Get the hell out of here. D.E.D. -E baby! Shit! Try not to take the hit there, but man, best laid plans. Jesus. You got stuck when you have to destroy the asteroids. Yeah, that is, the, yeah, yeah. I think everyone got stuck there. I got stuck there for such a long time. I don't know what they were thinking when they made that section, man. When they made that, I don't know. I think that part there is just to spite you as a player. I mean, we got no more heals right now. There. Yeah, let's go. Oh, shit! Oh, boy! That's right. Whew. April says that Mecha would lock Stank in one of these deck yeah, elevators from the beginning of this game. Crush <laughs> it! Balls! We have to do it, Steak. We love you so much that we have to. Hello there, Moon Jid. How's it going, man? Just life treating you. Good, I hope. Oh, screw this noise, man. Oh, get me the hell out of here. Aw, oh, let's be real. We would all do it to Stank. Because it's funniest when it's Stank. I can't go through that door. I was kind of hoping that I could. Yeah, I would. I'd do it too. I'd help Mecha. I would help Mecha, and Stank would be like the the butt of all jokes. It would be a merry old time, really. <laughs> we'd have fun, we'd have punch, we'd have dessert. We'd have lunch. Lunch. Like a pizza lunch or something. That or Jersey Mike's. Something tasty. Whew. Was replacing your water heater. Well, what kind of water heaters you get, dude? I'm just wondering, because I replaced a water heater a while ago, and I decided against getting, like, a regular boiler and went with something more... I went with an electric one instead, and I don't know if I made the right choice. A hey, red six, no love for him. Hell no. Hell no. <laughs> Sorry, stank. It's like that. Yeah, we'll leave you in the death elevator, and then we'll all cheer six 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 bits and send you down straight where you need to go. To your resort space. Oh, we got we got like trademark that April. Call it the Danger Vader. Yeah, yeah, it sounds metal. Yeah, I like that. Oh, that's good. This part. Oh, God, this part. I'll be okay. Jersey Mike's after lock and stake in the elevator. See? What'd I tell you? Sounds like a good day, right? That's my kind of day. Oh, hell.
So, you, you just know that after all this talk right now, that Stank is probably cheering for me to eat it. You know what, I was rooting for you, but now I want you to have a restart, SK. What the hell? Where the hell, where the hell did he go? He's out in the hall, isn't he? Oh god. We okay? I think we're okay. Just be okay. Yeah, we're okay. If, if, if it gets hairy, we have to quit. I don't mean like quit like the stream, we just need to quit out the game. We need to Dark Souls the hell out of this. the party dudes yeah <sighs> this is actually working out okay it's official your your curse works online <laughs> I'm sorry steak <laughs> don't mean to drag you steak Electric water heaters are excellent, is all you recommend. Yeah, the one that I've had has worked pretty well. It just hasn't... Ah! It's got... Well, yeah, it just... The water doesn't really run out, or the hot water doesn't really run out. Um, it saves a little bit of money here and there, I think. Well, but I got bad news for you, Stink. Welcome... Welcome to Dead Space, man. Here he comes, here he comes, here he comes, and let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, and... Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, they all go bad. That's true enough. You gotta have them repaired now and then. I've had mine repaired uh, a little bit so far. Not too much. Damn it. Okay. We're okay. Just gotta remember to keep using it. Keep using the fire. There's fire all around us. Whew. Yeah, we got nothing in the old inventory, do we? We sure don't. We've got a heal. That's about all we got. That's all we need. So, I saw that my Prince of Persia Let's Play was getting some play recently. I'm pretty happy to see that. I don't know, if you guys would like to see a few more Let's Plays, I can keep doing those from time to time. I wouldn't mind doing it. I actually recorded a challenge run of uh, RE2 recently. I, I recorded it last night. It's Clear A, No Save, Manual Aiming. Turned out pretty good. Got. Got it finished in, like, less than two hours. Where, where am I supposed to go? Oh, over that way. To the elevator? Okay. Well, that elevator doesn't even work yet. Gotta change that up. The monsters really want to give me a hug, I know. I don't want to hug them. That's the problem. Yeah, this is where we came in. Okay. Oh, well, we gotta go up then. Oh, the 
this sweet red wire. Jesus. Something about this kind of scares me a little bit. Yeah, I don't know. If I if I were to like do a serious speedrun of Moonshed, I would have to do it on like an emulator, or I would have to do it like on GameCube. On GameCube, you can skip cutscenes, so that makes it a little easier to do, right? I would have to get the GameCube version at some point if I really want to do it, and then I'd probably play it on like my Wii. Yeah, if I want to pull that off, Moonshed, I think I have to get the HD remaster of Resident Evil. <laughs> this is the one that I have to go in, this elevator right here. I was looking for it. My bad. Yeah. Fifty-six minutes though. Holy hell. God, that seems impossible. I gotta I gotta get those numbers. Excuse me, I gotta get those numbers down, man. Come on, let's roll, let's roll, let's roll. Shit, shit. Okay, that worked out. Oh, that was lucky. Yeah, a lot of those guys, uh, Moonshade will play it at 120 FPS. I might be able to do that, but I don't know, I don't know. I could probably do that. I don't think HD remaster is too intensive of a game. And for God's sakes, it was made back in 2002. Look at the repair invoice. Bolty 4 Gyro. Damaged landing repulsors. Okay, so uh, just literally everything is busted around here. That's the vibe that I'm picking up. Everything. Dunzo. Okay, we're ready. Thanks for those likes, guys. The developers of the remake watched that video of the speedrun and they were surprised. Well, they're surprised that people can play fast. I guess it's not exactly playing as, as intended. Let's go, let's go, let's go. <laughs> oh boy, we're okay. We're back where we were, everything's fine. Six minutes. Uh, holy hell! I gotta check. Out, I gotta check out what these guys are doing. Are they like? God, it sounds impossible. Like an hour and a half, maybe. But 56 minutes. It's crazy. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Come on, come on. Yeah. Woo. Okay. Oh. So parts of the run, we did not see Mr. X in the run and Sherry's part. He never crouched down. How the? How? How?
Dude must have dude must have done the impossible and found like the magic spots to make it work. Wow. Isaac, we can't stay here much longer. Hearing a lot of movement. Hold on, I got the data board. I'm coming back to tram control now. Daniel, get ready to go. Oh man. Well, mission accomplished, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> oh god we need we need, you know what we need we need hp dude hp we need it now and we need damage for the love of god damage and capacity oh my god we gotta keep this dude alive There it is. Yeah, when we use these explosions against them, this actually works really well. I don't think I've ever done this before without, like, throwing at them. Oh, that wasn't great. Come on, let's go. Let's go, buddy. They should have got that as a bug. Woo! Still alive! Oh! Oh, man. Hell. Yo, know, Mujit, I gotta start one of those remakes. Well, we made it this far and impossible, guys. It's a, we're not that far, but we... Yeah, a little bit farther than we did before. Things are okay. Yeah, baby. Oh, this feels good. Come on. Just running up on me, okay. I'm fine. Wait, where the hell's the board supposed to go over here? Oh, yeah. Data board reinstalled. System restart complete. Maintenance Thank you, Matt. Complete. Calling tram. It's clear. I appreciate that. I'm, uh... I like running a lot of war stuff. Hell, Silent Hill and Risen Evil are probably what I'm best at. But I'm enjoying, I'm enjoying this. I'm enjoying Dead Space. We're on board. Something hit the roof, but it seems operational. Quarantine lockdown is lifted, so you can get to the hangar. Comms are still down, though, so be ready for anything. What's the plan? You and Johnson fix up the Kelly. We report to the bridge. Standard emergency protocol. What? Protocol? Hammond, people are dying here. And I'm not losing anyone else. We stick to procedure. We'll get through this. We'll see. Don't enjoy speedruns, Moonjet. Uh, for me it depends. Like, if people speedrun an adventure game, you know, like a point-and-click adventure game, it's less exciting, right? Because, like, part of the joy of the point-and-click adventure game is the narrative. And if you're just blowing past, like, all the puzzles, you're blowing past all the story bites, um, you know, story bits, I mean, you're taking all the enjoyment out of it. Like, yeah, anyone can speedrun a point-and-click game, I guess. It's a point-and-click. 
But if you're doing like a speedrun of Resident Evil or something, or something challenging like that, you know, th then it becomes a little bit more enjoyable. Um, but again, if you're blowing past a lot of cutscenes, I can see how it might be a little less enjoyable. That's why when I run a lot of things, I tend to leave cutscenes in at least the first time around. Unless I eat. Unless I eat it for some reason. Hey, Jane, how's it going? Hope you're doing good, Jane. Staying alive and impossible, Jane. You don't get to see anything. You watch the RE2 remake speedrun, but you couldn't see anything. I've never really tried to speedrun RE2 remake. Right now, my goal with the remakes is to consistently earn a high grade. How's it going? I'm okay so far. I'm still alive. I decided before I came on here, I'm gonna do this on impossible. God help me. We were talking about Mario Kart from yesterday, Jane, and how well, like, you and April were doing. <laughs> and how you guys were kind of crushing me. He and everybody else. That was fun. Isaac, we made it to the bridge. It's... There's no survivors. Daniels is trying to get into the command computer. I was also talking about like some of the videos I'm putting out on YouTube recently and debating like what let plays I really want to do in the future. If you guys enjoy those things. Oh, you bought Helldivers 2, Jane? Oh, sweet. Have you tried it out yet? What have you got on you? Is that good? Haley, I need you to listen. The Ishimura's overrun with the fucking monsters. You didn't hear anything? What? No, the comms are still out. Isaac. We need to kill you and fix it now. <laughs> Got a damage report? Uh, yeah, it, it's there. Ah, <laughs> oh, Moonjade, you were so mad at me. <laughs> Go! Let's 
What's happening down there? Josh and Scott. Kelly and Till. The Singularity Corps overloaded. No! Kelly was our only way home. We're trapped. No! I'm not losing two good people for nothing. What about the command computer? It's a brick. All the primary systems are locked down with the captain's codes. So we find Captain Matthias. Track his rig. Okay. Hey, wait, Casey. Hilldivers okay, 2 here. is Captain really Benjamin fun, Mathias. yes. Location medical. Status deceased? Even the captain? God. Isaac, you're closer to medical. You can double back and cut through maintenance. Find the captain's body and get his rig. With his codes, we... What was that? Hilldivers 2 is great with a group of people. It is utter pandemonium. Like, there's just everything's coming at you all at once in the game, and you guys are trying to struggle to survive and stuff. Like, it's a great time. And uh, I've been streaming it for like the past couple of weeks on Twitch, and it's gonna be getting some crazy impressions on there. We've been getting a lot of impressions when we're streaming Hell Divers 2 on there, man. I'm shocked by it, but hell, people are like paying attention a little bit. Like I post a vi the vod over on my uh, my channel, Soul Keeper Gaming Vods. My people were clicking on it. Okay, fine by me. Where's the little man? Ah, uh, he's right over here. I got the little guy right here. No, it's not. It's not okay for him to see see too much of dead space. But every so often he can pop out. This guy dropped his help out on top of you when you re got revived. You, ha! Ha! you friendly fired him. Ha! <laughs> you know what? He had it coming. That's funny as hell. Oh my god. Moonjit, you actually did really good at Mario Kart. Like, you beat me, man. Granted. Yeah, it pretty much is... It's, it's just Starship Troopers, Casey. Are you fucking kidding me? Whew. It really is just Starship Troopers, but it's also got robots in addition to bugs. So, you know, I guess that's the difference. It's got a little bit of variety. It's got something for everybody. Well, I like playing with people. It is, uh, it's something to do with all the subscribers that we have, right? Moonjin got the drop on me during Mario Kart last night. I was like well ahead of him and then like a bunch of times he, he came out of nowhere. To be fair, I did it to him too. Alright, we made it to our first tram, dude. Oh my god, yes. Oh, 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 what a relief. <laughs> this is this this game is hard. be fair, SK, this is what you signed up for. Impossible. You'd be mad about it being hard. What do I have to buy here? I don't have... Wait, wait, wait. Actually, I can sell this. Yeah, baby. And we can get ourselves a more powerful suit. Yes! were hunting me. That's how mad you were. <laughs> you were so mad. It's okay. Hey. Looking good, Isaac. You know, what we need to do is we need to spend some uh, credits on those those nodes, man.
How does this work? Oh, we're going to medical, aren't we? Okay. Get to the medical deck. Yeah, that makes sense. Do I have any nodes right now? I don't think I do. Nodes, zero. Oh, crap. I'm excited for the next week. I think there's gonna be a lot of good stuff coming. Got a lot of things planned that I hope everyone's going to enjoy. I need more clearance to get in there. Use those likes, guys. Hello? Ooh, there it is. Now! Now we're gonna have some fun, baby. Oopsie daisies. Uh, I, I, I don't think there's anything important over there. Hell no. I had a funny feeling there was going to be something useful over there. Gotta hold the line. They all came back. R.I.P. Lady. Oh hell yes! No, it's not like she's gonna be needed anymore. <laughs> this pulse rifle. I've used this thing before. It's a pretty cool weapon. Matter of fact, we should probably we should probably have it assigned to our inventory. Sitting right on that. Hell yeah. The thing, one of the things I like about the Dead Space remake is that, like, all the weapons are actually kind of useful now. They don't feel like they used to be all that useful. If I remember right, in like the original game. In the original game, you could get by with just a line, or excuse me, a, a line rack and the plasma cutter, and you really didn't need anything else. All sorts of stuff you could grab, but it wasn't all that useful. Isaac, have you heard from Daniels? We were attacked. She ran the other way. No, nothing. Medical's a slaughterhouse. They barricaded access to the morgue. The morgue? Yeah. But the barricade was put together in a hurry. A hydrazine tank might blow it open. Yeah, just in a detonator, like maybe fire. a shock pad. And Cole could be through there if... Isaac. The one who attacked us. I swear to God it was Chen. But... I saw him die. If they barricaded the morgue, maybe it was to keep something in. God, this is going much, much better now. <laughs> I feel pretty good about running impossible. Well, better than I was, at least. Looks like Jax from Mortal Kombat. Oof. 
the way. Current position, main objective. So we're like already there. Oh, I thought we were like going someplace. Well, not yet, I suppose. Okay. I guess he kind of does, doesn't he, Jane? A little bit. A little bit. God, is that what Jacks from Mortal Kombat looks like now? I haven't played Mortal Kombat. I never played the new Mortal Kombat. I almost did, and then for some reason I didn't. But didn't they do a whole remake of Mortal Kombat 1? Did, didn't they? This guy looks like he's doing just fine. We'll leave him to his devices. Get on with your bad self, bro. They did do a remake. Of course they did. I never played it. Liu Kang is new riding? Like what, he's just he's just riding outright? It's kinda nuts. Like he's got electrical powers, all that stuff? Oh crap. Damn dude, go down! Is anyone eating like what flaming hots, Cheetos, and cream cheese? You're snacking and watching me. I that I have never heard of that flavor or that flavor combo. Cream cheese and flaming hots. How does that taste? <laughs> Cheetos and cream cheese. Hold on guys, I'm trying to decide if this is based or not. Probably is, but I have to use my judgment in a second. Uh, no, we need elevator. Please, please the cherry on top. Hot Cheeto fries. Okay, wait, hot Cheeto? What, Cheeto fries? Well, that's a little bit different. I think April might be high, guys. Oh! God, you called that. Jesus Christ. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Please be okay, please be okay. Oh my god. <sighs> okay. Should have known that the moment I heard Cheetos, flaming Hot Cheetos and Cream Cheese. Although part of me said, it's just, uh, it's just to tone down the heat. That's all it is. But another part of me said, oh, you know better than that, SK. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Man, he just tanked all of that. God. We yeah. is the modern, modern innovation. Yo, know, we should just let all the people who are high create all the recipes and see what they come up with. They might innovate, they might create garbage. Point is, they're being creative. Who knows, they might actually come up with something that tastes good. They might also come up with something that, you know, just makes you blow out the bathroom, but... Those are the risks you take. April, are you gonna blow out the bathroom after you're done watching me? Are you just gonna redecorate the inside of that bowl?
probably should have scared me. It did a little bit though. I didn't want to fold him over there, guys, but God Almighty. We had to fold him. Entering zero gravity. One more hit, we would have had to force a restart. That would be no good. Over here right now. Wait, wait. Gotta hurry. I want to dilly dally out here. I like a quesadilla. I used to order a quesadilla at Taco Bell all the time with Fran back when we went there. I stopped eating it because I got fat for a while. I had to lose a whole bunch of weight like a little over a year ago. I think I lost probably like 50 pounds. It was bad, it was bad enough that my doctor said, you gotta lose some weight, dude, because your blood pressure is spiking. better now though thankfully oh man oh this is trippy I'm gonna make sure I throw out another save Exiting Ta zero gravity. Taco Bell's not like what it used to be what what is Taco Bell like now then Still holding this position. What's happening there? Did you find Nicole? No sign of her yet. But I found some hydrazine that should work on the barricade. I just need to find a shock pad. Okay. Work fast, Isaac. 55 pounds. That's a lot of weight. Congratulations, Moonjid. Entering zero gravity. It was weird. Like on, on YouTube. A little while ago, like people were no people who were watching my videos noticed that I lost a bunch of weight, and I was getting a lot of comments about. It. I was getting a lot of comments about it to the point where it was getting weird. Still, you bastard. Got him. Phew. You know, I had an idea for a type of video that I, I am almost certain nobody would watch. But I thought to myself, what if what if I did like a vlog type thing where Check it out. You got Taco Bell for lunch? In addition to what you're eating now? Oh my god, April. <laughs> Dude, April is going to explode. It's going to come out like liquid fire. Yeah, thank you, Moonjit. I appreciate that. Yeah, I'm, I look a lot better than I used to, definitely. I had, a, I, had, I had an idea for a type of video that I am almost certain no one would watch. What I thought of doing was, like, doing this type of vlog where I started off with, like, uh, you know, eating something, or, you know, just, you know, you just yammering on about whatever topic, right? Then go on, move on to, like, a Let's Play, and then end it by working out. And I thought to myself, that sounds like a fun video, but I don't think anyone would watch that. And it essentially, it would just be like a, it would be a giant vlog or something.
Yeah, you see one of my old videos, right? Yeah. You probably see me on one of my old videos where I I am much more overweight. You can see it on some of my old vods over on Soul Keeper Gaming Vods, where I was like 50 pounds heavier. Casey is on the seafood diet. I, I respect that. That's a good diet. I kind of like that diet. I was on that diet for a while. Gotta say, it didn't work out for me. <laughs> hey, Knuckles, how you doing, bro? How's life treating you, dude? I was feeling frisky today, decided to play this on impossible. I can't help myself. Took one step out of the captain's nest and Chen, that thing, he almost got me. You okay? I trapped him in a damaged escape pot. He's snarling like, this is fucked up. Hurry, Isaac. I wish there was a save nearby. Is there like a save nearby around here? Stank. Stank. I think Stank might be on the seafood diet, too. <laughs> April... <laughs> April's gonna clear out the entire apartment complex with her... with her combination of Taco Bell and fl and flaming Hot Red... or flaming Hot Cheetos with cream cheese. The first fart creates biological warfare that descends upon her apartment complex. Just got home, you worked all day, then had bowling. That sounds fun. How'd you, bu how'd you bowl, Knuckles? They're gonna read you the riot act, April. You're gonna get evicted. Thank you, Matthew. The zero gravity is a little... It, it feels a little weird, but it's not that bad getting used to it, I don't think. Okay, I might I might be in trouble here. We're gonna find out. I've got I've got some <laughs> I got some stasis. I might be okay here. Thank you, Matthew. Let's do this. Come on, there it is. Yeah. Whew. I should have seen that coming. Take care of business, dudes. Yeah, I decided to play this one on impossible. Because I I wanted a challenge. I had to have a challenge, and a challenge I have gotten. I had one restart so far, and mmm, it tasted bad. You have it's two hundred a game. That's that's really good, dude. Holy hell, that's ridiculous. Mama Wick likes my new shave. She's been watching me just about as long as you as, as you have. Oh, well, thank you. So she's seen me get salty with some people over on TikTok. <laughs> I take it then. When I tell them to, uh, quote-unquote, F off. <laughs> Very harshly. I think that some people on TikTok are... Some people who who are who use TikTok, I think, have the mindset that I'm supposed to bend over backwards for them to get to get because I am desperate for viewers or something. And while I really need to have viewers, that doesn't mean I have to take crap. This is April's plan. She's gonna mask. She's gonna mask her gnarly dump with the smell of weed. 
That's a hell of a plan you got there, April. <laughs> What? I'm not, I'm not certain about this. Oh my god, yes, I found a save. Oh, hallelujah, hallelujah, I've got a save. Oh man. Remember guys, if, if there's potential for us to die, we have to quit or we're gonna loot, we're gonna lose the save file. Save file gets deleted on impossible if we die. Oh, man. Well, the only thing I would really want out of here is 10,000. That's your favorite part? Why do you want me to suffer? How many restarts do you want, Mecca? Mecca over here at the thought of me dying in on impossible difficulty. Yes. Yes. Good, good. <laughs> yes, everything is going according to plan. <laughs> yeah, pretty much, Mecca. That's that's why I like these guys say, dude, you can't bit just. You're never gonna grow if you ban everybody. I say, you're precisely the kind of person I should ban. Click. <laughs> what the hell? Let's try that again, shall we? There we go. Crap, this part. Oh, crap. Oh, we're in so much trouble. Oh, balls. All right, here we go, guys. Exactly, Red. Yeah, April, we're about to live life on the edge in a big way, because I don't know about this. Oh, okay, we're going to have to get creative here. Blaine, all those pets died in the apartment complex. <laughs> Alright, so Moonchase coming with some real lore here. That April is going to obliterate all the all the pets in her apartment complex. Because of her gnarly, gnarly dumb. Ah, oh, crap. Yeah, there it goes, dudes. Let's go! Lock and load, dude, let's go! Everything's alright still. God damn. <laughs> What's the bathroom going <laughs> What are these questions right now? What's the bathroom gonna do door gonna do when April is done? The paint is gonna melt off the wall. April, are you okay? April, I think you should, like, balance out your... You know what? April, if you could eat anything else to go with your Cheetos and cream cheese right now, what would you eat to balance everything out? So that maybe... M maybe it neutralizes, like, some of the horrible awful you're gonna lay down. Hills, how you doing? I'm sorry you've had such a bad day, Hills. I'm glad you're here, though. How's life treating you? The other day, stick. 
The other day, your mom farted so far, you threw up. <laughs> what the? No, that's fake. That didn't happen. It did not. You did not. <laughs> you did not. <laughs> did you? Alright, I could take like one more hit, I think. Balls. Alright. We did have a bad cough and the tr smell triggered a cough fit. Oh, oh, see, okay. It really did happen then. Well. I stand corrected then. Holy hell, Stank, you actually did it. You threw up because your mom farted. Do you feel proud? Also, did your mom hear what we were saying about her the other night? <laughs> I hear you down there, man. I, I, I don't want to come down there. Crap. Now they're going to make me do this. All right. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm alive. I'm alive. Nicole? Personal log, Dr. Nicole Brennan. With medication and zero G therapy, patient Harris is showing improvement. If this continues, there might be hope for the others on Aegis 7. However, Dr. Mercer continues to interfere. He claims Harris's delusions are religiously significant. If I have to make a complaint, I will. I'm not losing my patient over unitology bullshit. Not again. Tracking Greek signal. Dr. Nicole Brennan. Greek location? Inconclusive. Manual Greek tracking is available. I I like April's plan. Mask everything. Susan Admit Locke. nothing. Dr. Charles Mercer. Copy the message to terminal. I Ignore all consequences. Video feed from the colony. It's remarkable to finally see what I've sought all my life. The miners, this transformation, the divide death self. Sky is erring on the side of caution. His space has been shaken by these necromorphs, as he calls them. How strange. When my own faith has been so richly rewarded. Where's the without kind? I must study one of these creatures. Or the next best thing. Brennan's patient for example. Whew. Red Six, you only know that I'm here now. I am. I've been having a great time on YouTube. I like streaming on YouTube. You streaming on YouTube is pretty cool. Like, YouTube doesn't give me a hassle. It's kind of nice. Plus, I can stream in, like, a higher uh, bit rate than I do on Twitch. It's kind of great. Plus, you know, like, all my YouTube stuff is kind of in one central location. I get, you know, short-form content if I really want to make it. I got my long-form content. I got my live streams and stuff. A lot of great positives about YouTube. I like it here. Hope everyone else likes YouTube too. 
Hills is eating Taco Bell. All right, so Hills, April has eaten Taco Bell today. Now she's now she's a little high. She's, she's had a bit to smoke, and now she's having flaming hot Cheetos and cream cheese. Yeah, she's on that sweet, sweet oregano. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. You know what we're talking about. I'm gonna do a vlog. I'm gonna. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna execute my idea one of these days, guys. It's gonna, I'm gonna start the vlog with like one. One vlog is gonna start with Jersey Mike's. Another one's gonna start with Taco Bell. What what video game do you think goes great with Jersey Mike's, and which one do you think goes great with Taco Bell? I don't know. Pick up a line rack. I tried flaming hot Cheetos a while back. I I I it in there. God. Still in blue. We're not in the red yet, dudes. Oh hell. That could have gone better. Ooh. I hope your day gets better too, Hills. Oh, let's celebrate the 10th super for Moonjin! Moonjin, thank you for that generous $5 super, dude. Here, I'll tell you what. God. And now, folks, it's time for who do you trust? Hubba, hubba, hubba. Money, money, money. Who do you trust? April, you cannot mask the smell of death. LLLLLLLL. Ha 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 Ah, Muja, thank you so much for that $5 super, guys. I want you to hug it right now. Let's hug it out right now with the little man. Let's bring up the little man and spread some love across all of YouTube right now. Well, let's slap some quick three, everyone. Let's go ahead and hit it. Yeah, there it is right there, guys. I don't know if you want to hit that like button. Feel free to go hit that like button. Yeah, thanks, guys. And thanks, to little haggis, for being here with me. Let's go, man. Thank you so much, Moonjed. Yeah. <sighs> really appreciate that, Moonjed. You've been struggling. Oh, I'm sorry, your friend died, Hills. Oh wow. It's terrible. You got. Oh no, you got dumped. Without being told, like what? You just got ghosted? That's horrible. I'm so sorry that happened to you, Hills. Well, things will get better. It will. Sorry, I keep looking at Moonjay's super chat there. You cannot smash the smell of death. <laughs> <laughs> April, did you hear? 
Did you, did you hear Moonjed's text to speech? <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Yeah, oh, you got, oh, well, you did get ghosted. Yeah, I guess you just, yeah. What else are you going to do? You just got to keep moving forward. I guess it's better to know now than later. Yeah, I'm sorry that happened to you, too. Jesus Christ, I think, they, I think you got him, guys. Daniels isn't answering her rig link. What's your status? I found a shock pad I can use on the barricade. I'm heading back there now. Watch the voltage on that pad. I'm not losing anyone else. How long did you how long did you know your friend, Hills? Hey, a friend of mine died a while back. We were friends for a real long time. It was, uh, it was pretty hard getting over, well, you know, getting over it or moving past it. Because it was really unexpected. Yeah, it's one of those things you just uh, learn to live with eventually. Even though nothing is ever really the same. Let's move. KJ, since you were seven and you're 33 this year. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's a long time. Well, it'll get better. It'll take a lot of time, but it'll get better. Eventually. Yeah, that is, that's, that's terrible. I'm sorry for your loss, Hills. Hills, it will get better, and nothing lasts forever, you will be okay. Keep your head up and stay away from April's bathroom. Thank you, Moonjed, for that $5 super chat, dude. I really appreciate that. Yeah, man. Yes. Did you hear that? Stay away from April's bathroom. <laughs> there be nothing but horrors in there. Trembling things from the deep that no one should ever see. Things that once seen cannot be unseen. Thank you, Moonjet, again for the five dollar super chat, man. <laughs> you are right about, you know, we're right about the guy who ghosts him. 
Uh, he will come back around. He always does. You've been dealing with him 15 years of this? You're like, he just leaves and comes back? Yeah, he sounds like he's not... He's, he sounds deeply unserious. I think he should just, like, cut it off entirely and move on, really. Like, find someone new. There's always someone who's gonna... There'll, there'll be someone who will appreciate you more than that. Like, that just sounds like a fundamental lack of respect for you. If he's always just... I don't know, ghosting and then showing up at the most inconvenient times and stuff.